I would never have seen anything like this before. You know, these two giant multi hulls, very, very high performance, probably the fastest, well not probably, the fastest boats in the world going at it with each other. It's, it's going to be an incredible event. So changing from a soft sail to a hard wing, there's uh, quite a few different differences. The loading is very different, the way you trim it is different, uh, and the looks of it obviously is very different, so it's, you can't really compare the two. Uh, but in the end of the day, you look at heel angle, rudder angle, and boat speed versus target. So that hasn't changed, but uh, how to achieve that, uh, you've got some different tool, tools to play with. You know, the planning went really well. And um, the load testing went well, and it, I mean, for that to happen, it's just a full credit to all the designers and the engineers and the builders to, you know, to get it to that level. Um, oh, I think it's just amazing to to be able to put a wing of that size on a boat and fly the hull on the first day. It's like, uh, I don't know, getting ready to go to the moon. It's just the most extreme vessel ever attempted to be built on the planet and uh, it feels like we're, we're off into, into space. How far do you push the boat? How far do you push yourself? What are the boat's limits? We don't know. We're discovering what the boat can do. And we're discovering what we can do as sailors, as engineers, as designers, as shore crew. And if we've done our job well, we can go out and race this boat and bring home the America's Cup. <laughs>